Hey everyone, it is Meat Shrimp here, and I'm back with some single player, and this time I got the Technic Pack installed, and I'm going to play a little bit of that, I'm going to try to build craft a little bit in a creative server with my friend, and I watched a few videos, and I'm really interested in Tale of Kingdoms, getting that going, so I'm going to do that, and I'm going to start a new conquest. All right, so now that we did that, builds this little gravel path right behind me. And if it wants to load right, builds this castle, which I'm sure by now you guys have seen quite a bit of. And this is part of Tale of Kingdoms, this castle is. All right, so, let me see, I got the thing with this volume is that got its own audio mod and it doesn't adjust the birds and all that from that audio mod oh. alrighty which way am I going? no, this way I think it's up the stairs here. If I'm not mistaken, wait. So we go up the stairs and then up the stairs again. Gotta go talk to the main guy and start this contract so when I kill bad guys, I actually get credit for it. Sign up. Exit. Alright, if you guys see in the top right corner of the, I think it's Zan's minimap, and I am, I have that turned on to show a few things, uh, basically any other moving thing, and then when I die, it'll show me where I died at, so that's pretty cool. Alright, so. Every time I tried loading this, I always start off in the forest. It seems like I always start off in a forest no matter what. It's kind of annoying. But let's start chopping on some trees. Like the beginning of every Minecraft video. And this has a mod on it where if you chop down the bottom log of a tree, you get all of the... The whole tree falls down. But... You have to use an axe for that, so. Let's get this first tree, make an axe, chop down wood like crazy. Alright. Let's keep these for now. Crafting table, put that down. More sticks. Oh, we need more. I don't want to use all my wood. I think I want to make a wood house. All right. And with this mod, I'll be able to. Yeah, this also has world edit installed, which I'm not sure how to turn off without reinstalling it. So I might have to look that up. I guess, I mean, it isn't a huge deal, as long as I'm not using a wooden axe all the time, but, oh well. Go birdie. Oh yeah, you can hear the swiping sounds you got there. It's pretty cool, I guess. You know that kind of thing, I guess. Oh, that was a big ass tree. Sorry, getting messages on Skype. Okay. Which would I got? Almost a full stack already. Start building the house. Get protection because there's some fucking evil things living out here now. I'm actually just gonna build my house around my crafting bench here. So, I'm gonna 
build to the outline of the bed. Sorry for this guy, but I don't wanna... Alright, he's, he's dead. I didn't tell him I was doing a video, so... He can't be put to blame. Alrighty. Eh, it's a good house for now. And then... Only because I want to make this really quick. I'll turn those into wood. base looks cool. That's all that matters. Get a tree. Yeah, I'm still learning all the mods that are even on this pack. I know there's more than just build craft and tale of kingdoms and mole creatures as far as big mods go. There's like, I think, red power and a bunch of other stuff. I, I have to look millionaire. That's a fun one, which I already know a little bit about. Not a whole ton. All right, so I got a basic house. Just need protection for the night. That was cool. It, uh, you guys probably didn't notice, but since I had more wood in my inventory, or at least on my hot bar, when I ran out, it automatically switched to it. So that's going to move this over. And I need to make a pick. And hopefully, I can find some. What's it called? Stone somewhere. Make a chest real quick. Keep those in there. Alright. And I found it is probably better to build your house close to the Tail Kingdom's place, but if you can see in the mini map, there's like a little square outline where it basically goes. Like, I'll show you real quick up here. Like, like how, see, they put all this dirt here. Um, but, like, how it cuts off right there. Don't build inside of this cutoff. Because when you repair the town, it'll just, like, it, all it does is resets the town. It doesn't actually rebuild it or nothing. So, anything that's in there will just disappear. Like, it was never even there. So, if you decide to build in there, you're going to lose all your stuff. But if you build right outside of it, that way, when you die or whatever it's a lot easier to find your house now with this mini map you can also set waypoints so you can find your house that way like for if you're venturing and don't plan on dying so you can do it that way which I believe is C and just name it house keep it that color press ok so that way if I just want to go on like a short adventure like this and I don't plan on dying, or just planning to get some stuff and coming back, then I can find my house, which is a really nice feature. And if I get too far out, I can press X and see the waypoint on my screen, and I can zoom in really close or have it all the way zoomed out. And I can also see what's around me too, which is nice. And the X in the top right corner, if you can see it by the water, I think is my spawn, if I'm sure. Or, oh no, it's already got death points on here. Oh, it must be from other playthroughs on a different map. But I don't know, that's weird that it has those on there. Okay, exit menu. Alright, really need to find some cobble before it gets dark. And this mod pack does, if you do a full install, it does have, what is it called? Um, oh, a kitty. Well, yeah, it has a kitty. But it has <clears throat> single player commands, which I think has something to do with, ooh, fucking scorpions, uh, with 
the world that it and whatnot. But I don't know. I think I f so that's <clears throat> why that's popping up, and I don't plan on using either. But I think that excuse me, scorpions have the same exact properties as like cave spiders, basically cave spiders, basically, as in they. <clears throat> don't hurt you in the daytime, or not cave spiders, but like regular spiders, excuse me, <laughs> okay, sorry about that, uh, as spiders, I'm not trying to swim here, someone's already been here, because they, I can't use stone to make furnaces, because they don't hurt you in the daytime, um, and they just like climb everything. I mean, obviously they're a little different, but as far as that goes, I think they're they follow those rules. Yeah, that's another thing that sucks about being spawned in a forest. You either gotta find a cave or a way out of the forest to find any thing, really. And I can't see my waypoint, so let me see if I can change the color. I don't know. Oh yeah, that's how you change the color. I can see it's just way off map. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm not finding cobble. Which means I'm not going to be able to make any lights. But that's fine. I just need to get home. It is starting. Yeah, and as far as the white and red dots everywhere, I'm pretty sure red is monster, white is like not monsters, and then I think green is just anything that is moving basically. Like any of the all the NPCs that aren't in the game naturally. Fucking a. They're right on my tail. Jeez. Oh, I actually survived so far the first night, which is nice. Um, yeah, and this comes with like chest settings so you can split them up in weird ways. I don't know how that works exactly, but I'm gonna make a sword. <clears throat> I'm gonna more wood and boom that should be enough make one sword and I'm not going to venture normally what I like to do for whatever reason is venture really far off but I'm like right when I start but I'm not going to do that I'm going to stay close to home gather what I can from here and once I get built up a little to where I won't die if I venture off, then I will venture off. Alright. Break down this little door I made. Kill some bitches. Yeah, like that sword sound. Like, it's really loud and obnoxious, and I gotta find out how to turn that off. <clears throat> but, you know. Yeah, so what you gotta do to split up your path to kingship is kill monsters basically get those little gold pieces or whatever they are I don't even know so I got poison it's affecting my hunger it looks like instead of my health so I wonder if there's different kinds of poisoned it's interesting yeah I forgot to get food but that's fine. Oh, and there's like werewolves and stuff too now. Like there's one right there and they're fucking bitches. So I'm not, I'm just gonna run away because I don't like werewolves. As you can imagine, they are not fun. Yeah, he followed me. There's something on top of my house. All right, I'm gonna put all this away except for I'll keep this. And I don't have a 
can't make a bed yet. Maybe if I run to the kingdom, I can go sleep for the night. I'm gonna be a little girl about it. And I know there's something right on top of me. Oh, fucking werewolf. Okay. Hopefully, I will be able to go inside and the guards will take care of him if he's still following me. Which I don't think he is. Okay. I think if I go in here, I can rest for the night. Or at least a little bit. Uh, waiting room for night. Wake up. Exit. Yes. I hit it. Exit. Oh. It's. What? How long do I have to wait? <clears throat> Did you have to guess when it's daytime or. What? It's interesting. Yeah, daytime. That's cool. The mini map shows them it's daytime and nighttime, which is pretty cool. And there's a mob bad guy over here. Oh. The werewolves. Oh, turn back into a person. But he still is a bad guy. And so is a creeper. Never got a fuck. See, luckily, that's what good about spawning over here. Or building close to your spawn. I've never got the hang of that knocking things back by sprinting thing. Where's my death point? Right there. Oh. Hey, buddy. Oh, did I lose my sword? Nope, there it is. Kill that fox, even though I'm gonna kill this guy. He had sticks. You're hurting me, you're hurting me. Stop it. I don't care if I'm hurting you. You were a werewolf and you tried to kill me. No excuses, sir. At least I get the more creatures talking bits have gotten a little better. What the hell is like something's crying. Fuck if I know. <clears throat> All right, let's go back into our little house here and grab our pick and let's go kill some animals for food. I really need to find some cobble. I'm about to just take it from there. Because all I have to do is just give them a stack of wood and they fix the whole place. So, I think that's what I'm going to do. Oh, it's stairs. I don't really think that's cheating. It's just being innovative. I guess that might be a little cheating. I just need enough for an oven. All I need. And then I can make a mine. I just could have made the mine first. Ooh, apple tree. That'd be nice to have. Chop this. Oh, I didn't bring my axe. It's fine. I think it just gives me regular wood, but yeah, just regular wood. But the saplings are what I want. On this tree. There we go. I am not seeing any animals now. What's this? A jellyfish. I think jellyfish give you slime balls. And they poison you. Awesome. Jeez. Jesus, shoes are freaking giant. Oh shit. Sorry, bro. Yeah, that's right. Burn. I don't want him. I want him to burn, but not in the water. See, there. Good enough. That's the other thing about forests. Is that monsters don't always despawn because they don't burn under the trees. 
bitch sucks. <clears throat> Alright, we go back to my house. Make a furnace. So I can start. Oh, there's a cave right there. Or maybe a little. I'll have to go down there. Alrighty. To find my house again. They added no sounds, pretty much everything you do. <gasps> More seeds! Aww, I have apples. <gasps> Yay! Um, um, no. Franklin. Hello, you want, you want to be my buddy? <gasps> they only take one apple. Um, Philip. All right. What can I have to build a horse saddle? All right, you guys come inside. Come to my house. Don't die. You guys gonna follow me, Franklin? Philip? Franklin? What do I need? I have seeds. You guys follow me? Will you spawn on me? I don't know how this works. I've never had a pet before. I've never had apples to get horses before. Yay. I don't know how this works. Alright. I am going to put this in my chest. Which I need to turn that off. So it goes right in my chest right away. And get some wood that kind of wood and make a furnace real quick and then while that stuff's burning I will be looking up how to get horses while wait no I'll do it this way alright so while that's burning I'm gonna look up how to tame horses it won't be more than a second for you though Okay, so I only got three charcoal out of that. I need, did I drop it? No, it's in there. Okay. So I can make some torches. And I found out that I need iron and leather to get, um, dude, just lost word. Did make a horse saddle. Which, leather I can get just from going and killing some cows, but I'm going to need iron for mining, which I'm going to start doing here in a second. After I block off my door. Well, make a door. Alright. Alright. Put this wood back. Put some torches up in here. Go inside. Put some torches around my house. Both on top of my house. Right there. That should be good enough for I think I'll just put my mine. Where do I want it? I'll just put it like right here. There we go. That works.
turn back every ooh, few steps here. Does that work? Yeah, okay. My lighting's a little messed up because I don't have smooth lighting on. Because it kind of messes up on this computer, but that's fine. Alright, so I'm just going to go down. And then make a little strip mine, which I'll probably do off camera, but... I'm just going to record for now. And if it just is boring, I will skip it. I'm hopefully find, I'm gonna find like a cave or something or other. Alright. <clears throat> yeah, if I don't find anything besides just coal in the next two torches, I will stop recording and come back when I find something interesting. That seems fair. And I'm sure you guys won't be too terribly sad to miss me mining. Wow, just tons of coal here. I have to break my pick on this coal. Well, I'll come back for it. I don't need all of that yet. Yeah, and if you watch the Adult Diaper Adult Diapers channel, which you should if you watch this, um, we did a let's play together, and I don't know if it's out yet, but I've had a lot of luck. Oh, right when I say that, I've had a lot of luck finding diamond, at least on the let's play we were doing. So, I and mean, that was by strip mining. So hopefully that luck stays through to my single player, but we'll see. Alright. Oh, I need that cobble, wood, don't need dirt, oh, don't need that, okay, this one I need to do. Make a pick. Just strip mining, I shouldn't need a sword, but I will need some torches. So I'm just gonna make as many as I can. Right, the rest of this is going in the chest. Alright, so I was gonna stop recording once those torches went out if I couldn't find anything, but I think I'll just do it now because it doesn't look like I'm going to find anything. So, if I do, I'll start recording again, but until then, I will see you in a second. Okay, I probably should have kept it recording, because I didn't go down that much further. Maybe just like, two or three more levels, and I found, first off, some iron, which isn't that exciting. More coal, not too exciting. Then I kept digging, and I found this which doesn't blend well with this texture pack, but that's okay. And I don't know exactly what it is, so let's find out. I'm assuming it's something from Buildcraft, but not sure what. It is copper, which I have no clue what to use copper for, but there's a ton here, so that might just mean I got lucky or it's not too rare, which I don't think copper in real life is that big of a rarity, but found copper, got some more coal, pretty excited, um, probably just gonna keep mining, just thought I'd show you guys, found something, you know, something new, something, I, I think copper is related to build craft, not 100% sure, there's so many mods in here, I don't even know what they all are, that I'm not sure if it's related to build craft or what. I'm gonna try to figure out which way I was going. 
I come down here. Oh yeah, this is where the iron was, the first bit. Which means place that there. Oh, go down more. Alright, well, I'll see you guys if I find a cave or diamond or something. Alright, see you in a second. Alright, a few more levels down, after finding some more iron and copper, I found this, and it doesn't match a texture pack, so I know it's something from the mod. I'm not sure what it is, and I think I'm going to need an iron pick to pick it, because the stone wasn't doing it very fast, and it looks pretty fancy, which it might be ruby. I don't know if there's rubies in the game, don't know what they're for. I think you make tools out of them, so. And I don't know if they're better than... Oh, there we go. I get lost easily. Alright, I know it's a little laggy. I don't know why it's doing that. Probably because I'm moving around so much. Alright. Or my render distance is probably up too high. For mining, yeah, there we go. Oops, yeah, it should not have been at normal or far or whatever it was, just for mining. All right, so need to smelt. I got 24 iron ore, so we'll smelt this, get three going. I think I got some chickens which I can smelt. Um, Put some copper ore away, put some cobble, gravel, flint, whatnot, all that away. Get some sticks. Don't have enough sticks, so I need more wood. There's two. Need one more. Acquire hardware. Oh, this is fancy. And then I can make a pick. Nice. And then take the iron out real quick, make some chicken. Almost, I have about half left, so let's make this iron pick real quick. Ba boom See, that one is almost dead anyway, so it's kind of perfect timing to make it. And then I'm going to just make a stone shovel, because I am running into some dirt, and it's kind of a pain in the butt. Alright. Says chicken's done. Put the iron back in there. And now I'm on that chicken. <clears throat> and let's go see what this stuff is. 90% sure it's ruby, just because it's red, and I know there's ruby in this game, but I am not certain what it is. So we shall find out. Yeah, see, so not even that far down and find something interesting. And it is Ruby, so I'm gonna have to look up how much better Ruby is than iron, or if it is better, and maybe start using, oh, and there's more copper. Maybe start using the Ruby one. So now you keep, there's like ruby, sapphire, emerald, and I think that might be it. There might be a purple one somewhere, but maybe, I think there's copper too. I'm not exactly all sure what there is. But alright, off to a good start. And I am going to take a quick second to check out the ruby specs weapons all right so I couldn't really find anything because I couldn't find what mod it's from but I'm assuming since it's a gem that it's better than iron I'm not certain though so I won't use it just yet just to go Alright, I am going to continue mining. Oh, I found a cave or nothing. Yes, okay, so I am going to continue mining. And once again, I will see you guys. I'm going to find something interesting. Alright. 
Alright, so started a little strip mine and right away I got, I still have the four rubies, got some redstone, silver ore, I got ten of that, seven tin, uh, some more iron, uh, more copper, I found some sapphire, some emeralds, and some uranium ore, which don't know what that does. I know that sapphire, emerald, and rubies can be used to make what you call them tools like swords whatnot as for everything else I have no clue so I'm gonna make an iron pick to get some more coal but that's besides the point um so yeah I found some nice goodies and pretty excited and now I can I have enough iron to make a horse saddle. All I have to do is find my horses and they won't despawn because they, uh, they're my pets. Keep the important stuff in my chest so I can't hold everything. Iron, I uh, don't need flaxseed. Don't even know what flaxseeds are. Um, don't need an egg more cobble in there. I do need a sword. So, boop, boop. Make that. There we go. Alright, while well, all that iron's going, I'll go find me some cows. And peaceful mobs are this way. Oh, a deer. I'm, I'm interested if they give you any sort of hide. So I need leather. Doesn't necessarily have to be got from a cow. Uh, fucking annoying. Oh, oh, lemon tree. Orange tree. Let's see if I can get an orange tree sapling. Oh, I'm not even hungry. Sake. I'm gonna freaking numb on these. Um, no saplings so far. Hopefully, I get one. Where'd you get them from? The oranges. Orange seed. Okay. So, just keep the oranges on me. And that's another apple tree. Right? Yeah, that's gotta be. Need to find a cow. Plenty of deer. I saw some cow when I first got here, but I don't know where they're at now. Some cow. Cows. I think. Yeah, that makes more sense. Cows. Alright. Cow, cow, cow. This tree is green. Oh. A little lag there. Oh, that's. That's, uh, oil. I am going to. Set a waypoint, name it oil, and make it some color. Make it white so I can see it. Mm -mm -mm. There's a kitty, don't know how to tame them. Looks like I'd have a little pet kitty. I'm trying to find. I don't think I ever have this much trouble finding a cow. But once I do, all I need is five leather. There's a horsey again. I'm gonna kill this guy. All I had on him was a pick. Uh oh. Oh, there's bubbles. I saw something. Brother, wait, is your brother? 
There's that bunny. Where's where's my other horsey? So I have no clue. So he's tamed and he's mine. But I wonder if I need wheat to take him back home. a little obnoxious. Oh, there's some map not loading over here. Interesting green jellyfish. Cows. We can go back to base. Seems like we're out there. I, I feel like I'm not finding any animals at all. Which way is base? This way is base. Oh, there's some bad guys starting to spawn. It's on the left. Bunny. In my head? No. Oh, he's on my head. Bunny, 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 bunny. So you don't need to tame bunnies to get them in your head. It's pretty cool. Bunny head. Bunny head. Okay. Bunny. Oh yeah, get some bunny. I guess that's kind of cool you can kill. No, bear strap fish. I found out that last time I was playing. Um, um, oh, there's a goat. And a baby goat. Whoa. They dropped leather for sure. Alright, how many leather sacks? I need... Three. I don't know what was throwing me back like that. Maybe it was a goat nudging me. Alright, I'm gonna let Fraps load. Or stop Fraps so I can load this rope. Alright, I was wrong. That wasn't Fraps not loading. That was this mod pack. For whatever reason, it does that. It's interesting. Because it doesn't. Ooh. Like, you can still walk on this stuff. Whatever's there. And it does load, it just takes a second. Oops. Alright, I need to find more animals to kill for food. Should we eat this tomato? Oh, that should be good for now. So I need two more leather and I can make that horse saddle. And then I can find my horsey again. And I will be able to ride them. Which will be nice. And wow, nothing's loading. So I might just have to pause the video, hope it loads, and then resume when I find some cows. So I, I, I'm going to do that. Okay, so while looking for cows, I found these little baby cheetahs. And even though they're babies, they're strong. Like, I attached this one, and they're just fucking. See, like, for being so small, they should not be that strong. But luckily, oop, I knew where I was at. I was just right over here. But yeah, they are wicked strong for being tiny little things. So, don't mess with baby cheetahs. And I assume small cheetahs, or their small cheetahs are that strong that big ones are pain in the butt. Oh yeah, decided to eat my uh, tomato, and I found an avocado. Oop. Oh, stupid sticky keys. For a, I haven't used Windows in a while, and I forgot about the whole shift thing and sticky keys and whatnot. So... Yeah, but still no luck finding a cow, like, at all. There's something over here. Bunnies. I'm gonna put one on my head. So, can you get my head too? Swap them out. Alright. 
That's a bunny on my head. There's something up here. Can't see what it is yet. Oh, well, there's a ravine right there. There's a deer, that's what it was. And it is getting nighttime. I do have some stuff on me, so I'm gonna start heading back home. I'm gonna delete that. Waypoints. Before I forget. Move. Death points. If not, then I get confused which ones are which, and it can be a hassle. Uh, I didn't drop anything. There's a deep pool in the middle of nowhere. Okay, lucky I got an iron sword. Oh, my bunny helmet died. So it shouldn't be that bad, but... I don't have any armor. And I think I ventured out a little far. That music is still... Seems really loud for me. So I would assume it would be loud for you, too. Alrighty. Oh god, there's a few coming. Oh, creepers. I think skeletons and creepers are what will do me in. Spiders can be a pain in the ass, but... They don't really hurt me. And I'm going the wrong way. Those mean wolves? No, those are nice wolves. I don't have any bones. Oh, there's a pig. I'll be damned if I find a cow right now. Yeah. Finally avoided a creeper attack. Oh my god. They are just around my house. Ha, huh, creeper blew your ass up. Damn. Shit, go collect all this shit. Okay, almost to my house. It is really nice having those waypoints, or else I'd get completely lost. Back almost back to the village is just on the other side of the village, I believe. And I'm kind of bummed I can't find the. Whatchamacallits? Again? Really? It's gonna get annoying. So I don't even know what I'm in or what's going on. And they drop coal. It's kinda cool. I don't know. I don't know what's there that's not loading, but whatever. We're back home. You can't see it yet, but I can, or you can probably see it on the map, but I don't know if that tree was there before. I don't remember. Fucking really? Jeez. You got me some money. Oh, that's nice. Alright, let's go inside. Put some of this coal. I need to make another chest, is what I need to do. So, alright. I'll put this chest like over here. We can open the bottom one, but I can't open that one. is an ore. That's an ore. Tin ore. Copper ore. Silver ore. That's just, just done. So it's that silver. Alright, I'm gonna smell all this and probably end the episode here. 
I know I didn't do a whole lot, but at least I've got a house. I've not died a bunch of times, and I got a good start. So I really like this pack, this technique pack, and I'll leave a link in the description. It's really easy. It's just I think technicpack.net. Um, don't go to .com. It brings a really weird website. Um, it's not a bad website or anything. It's just really weird. But I'll leave a link for it and whatnot. And I plan on continuing the series because I've been really liking this Technic pack. And the more I learn, the more interesting it gets and the cooler it gets. And so this is just a start. And I promise, promise you guys to continue this series. But thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you really like me. And see you guys later. Bye.